I think it's wonderful. I don't have an issue with it. Oh, the colors. Yeah, just the, the nice, uh, almost neon colors that are popping out. Yeah, I think it'll look good when it's done. Yeah, I love it. I think it's beautiful. I love all the colors. I think it's bright, it's inviting, um, which is important because it's the first thing people see when they, you know, come over the railroad tracks right into Murray Hill. They're talking about this, a massive mural that will feature Bill Murray. Like the intention was to be super bright and colorful to draw attention to the neighborhood. Jason Tetlack is painting this 80 foot blank wall. That's the length of two T-Rexes. But not everyone is a fan. To be honest, it's not my dad. I don't, I don't like it. I like to have mural in the neighborhood, but uh, not like that. Of course, I would love it if everybody was super excited and loved everything that I did, but realistically, I know that there are always gonna be people who are gonna not care for the product, so I just try to block that out a little bit. Tetlack originally brought the design to the Murray Hill Merchants Association. And it didn't look like they were gonna be able to help me do the funding part of it that I was hoping for, so I just changed, like pivoted and went a different direction and decided to crowdsource it instead. A change.org petition has been started to try and change the design. It has over 100 signatures. Uh, Bill Murray's great. I mean, cool. I mean, I wish there was somebody, you know, that everybody loved, but you know, you can't please everyone. I think having that is better than just having a blank canvas. Bill Murray is a good choice though. Like I say, his last name goes along with the area, so why not use Bill Murray? It's just, it's just a fun project. That's the whole point of it is to have fun. In Murray Hill, Abigail Curran, First Coast News, on your side.